Starry Dome. Uh, this is going from bar uh, 16, um, where the chords are. And what we're going to do is play from here to here. So the first thing to note is that we've got a treble clef here in the bass, in the left hand, in the bass clef, where should the bass, bass clef should be. We've got a treble clef, which means we're going to read the notes as if we're playing the right hand. And we're going to play them in the right place. So B and G is going to be here, above middle C. Uh, it's the right place for those notes. And you're going to follow these notes here, reading them in the treble clef until you get to bar 20. And just there you see a little bass clef. So you go back into the bass clef. But then note here, at bar 25 or bar 24 just at the end the treble clef comes in and again you're going to play those notes uh, with the left hand but read them as if they were in the right hand of the treble clef um, and this is just a repeat of this part here so um, it's not too complicated right let's have a look so use the correct fingering two four And then move down to the C and the G. And then down to there. And I suggest you play that a few times. Sorry. One, two. And then in bar 20, we've got. And then down to the bass clef now we're reading up to D flat and G flat, make sure you get that fingering right, and then A flat and D flat, down to G flat and C flat, and then finally B flat and F. And then just go through that a few times until you feel confident where you're going. Moving down, slightly up there and then down okay now we're going to do the right hand um, if you notice these two notes pinch one and two and then go up to the G and A flat that's these two chords here and then we just move up so they're just going to be it's literally just going up a semitone each. That one to there, that one to there, and that one to there. And then back down again. And then this chord. Move your hand to here. And do that a few times. Obviously we've got minims in there. And maybe try and put that together. You can do that a few times, those two bars. When you feel confident, move on. And do those bars again. And then just do the whole lot again. And then obviously we've got the, the next part. We've still got these pinch notes here. Just playing all the way through again. Uh, on pedaling, so we've got the pedal goes down. Um, so we go chord, pedal, up, down, chord, pedal, up, down, chord, pedal, up, down, up, down, chord, pedal, up, down, up, down, up, down. 
Settling on each one. Up, down. Up, down. So you, you don't hear them blending into one another, but you do hear them going together. We've got that nice blend there. So pedal down, up, down. And just do that a few times. Then you've got this run. is all just repeating notes. C, D, F. C, D, F. So that's just with the B flat and the F first. And then the next section, all it is is the same notes in the left hand, but you're breaking up the chord here. Instead of playing this, you're playing uh, and then you can work that out through to bar 30 um, because it is just the same as doing the chords. Okay. 